Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into all things Grey's Anatomy because there is just so much juicy drama to unpack. I mean, seriously, did you catch that season 19 finale? Talk about a cliffhanger. Okay, let's break it down. So, in case you missed it, Teddy Altman, played by the amazing Kim Raver, collapsed right before she was about to perform life-saving surgery on Sam Sutton. I mean, can you believe the nerve of the writers to leave us hanging like that? But hold on to your seats because here comes the twist, Deadline spilled the beans on the cast season 20 contracts, and guess what? Kim Raver is back, baby. So, no need to panic about Teddy's fate anymore. Phew. But wait, there's more. Kevin McKidd, Camilla Luddington, and Katerina Scorsone have also signed on for season 20. And let's not forget about our OGs, Chandra Wilson and James Pickens Jr., who are also sticking around. Seriously, could Grey's Anatomy even exist without them? Now, let's talk about the leading lady herself, Ellen Pompeo. Rumor has it she'll be appearing in at least four episodes of season 20. And hey, even though she's not a series regular anymore, she's still our queen, right? Plus, she's an executive producer and does that iconic voiceover at the beginning and end of each episode, so she's still very much a part of the Grey's world. And can we just take a moment to appreciate the return of Alex Landy as Dr. Nico Kim and Jessica Capshaw as Dr. Arizona Robbins? I mean, who saw that coming? Plus, there are two new faces joining the cast, Natalie Morales and Freddie Mears. I can't wait to see what kind of drama they'll bring to Grey Sloan Memorial. But wait, there's even more tea to spill. Debbie Allen teased that season 20 is going to be hot, unpredictable, and compelling. And with a new showrunner, Meg Marinas, at the helm, I have a feeling we're in for one wild ride. Oh, and did I mention the potential for romance? I mean, with all these characters coming back and new ones joining the mix, anything could happen. And don't even get me started on the drama between Joe and Link. Can they make it work? Only time will tell. But hey, speaking of time, could season 20 be Grey's Anatomy's last? Well, according to Meg Marinas, she's not been informed of that, so let's keep our fingers crossed for more seasons filled with love, drama, and surgical miracles. All right, fam, that's all I've got for now. But you know I'll be keeping my eyes peeled for any Grey's Anatomy updates, so make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on the latest gossip. Until next time, stay dramatic.